Good morning ladies and gentlemen and welcome to another fantastic day on planet Earth. I'm out on this again testing it because um, I've had to do a few changes. Oh, I've popped the power up a bit more. Changed a few other things, you know. So the regen now, there's the regen kicking in. 160 watts and there's the brake which still needs pumping up a bit more. Right, let's see what this thing actually peaks at. For some reason, my speed isn't displaying, which is a bit weird. Oh well, using that phone, that's Android 8. Android 8 does not like things. Oh, it's a beautiful morning. Lovely and quiet, no people around. Bloody Android 8, bag of shit. No cars coming. Here we go. I've also done a complete instructional video on the BMS and how to connect it, the minimum that you need and and all the VBMS options, absolutely everything. It took me, it took me about three hours to video it, and then it took me another five hours, believe it or not, to edit it because of all the swearing and God knows what. So hopefully everybody will be able to understand it fully rather than emailing me all the time and saying I don't know what to do. And I don't mind people emailing me and saying they don't know what to do. But when the instructions are out there, I'll have, a, uh, I'll have a reason to say, well, why are you doing that? Because there's an instruction manual for it. Yeah, I'm doing loads of testing. I'm, I'm riding around at this speed, uh, stopping, checking the motor, make sure, making sure it doesn't get too hot, check the phase wires, check absolutely everything, because the last thing I want for it is for it to uh, burst into flames. Yeah, no suspension. But I'll tell you what, these 10 inch tyres, they make a hell of a difference. They make it so much smoother. And with the 8 inch ones, I couldn't bloody see the best of times, but now, and I don't know what this 360 camera is going to look like, I don't think you're going to get a lot. Now, this is quite a steep hill, so we'll maintain our speed of 15 and a half miles an hour. <laughs> oh yes, that's going to put a lot of strain on it. Should get a bit of heat generation going there. So now we'll pull up, put the e-brake on, which still needs raising even more. I think I've got it set to 40 amps now. And we'll check the motor temperature. and the motor temperature is warm. It ain't not, I'd say around about 20 something degrees, 22, 23 degrees, that's all. No, that ain't getting hot. The phase wires ain't getting hot, nothing's getting hot. One thing I need to change is the deceleration or the, 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 the throttle deceleration value because um, I've set it to zero I think uh, so as, as soon as you get let go of the throttle the regen comes on and I need some warning. No, no, it's warm, it's not hot. When I can't touch it with my fingers anymore that's when it becomes too hot. That's fine, that's fine. Phase wires are warm. Again, they're not hot. Let's see what we're uh, running at. Maximum f maximum speed, maximum voltage, maximum minimum voltage and maximum and everything else. Turn that off. I don't like riding down here because there's friggin' metal all over the place. Give 
give it some. This should be a good test as well for the heat generation because this is slightly uphill. And I'm now going flat out, so it's pulling 1.8 kilowatts out of that poor little 300 watt motor. <laughs> oh, regen, regen. I'll go back up here. Let's see what the temps are like now. Ah, it's it's getting it's getting hotter, but it's not it's not hot hot. It's not it's not so as you can't put your hands on it. So, and I have been sort of hammering it. I should be able to get back on my mo uh, my motorbike. I should be able to get back on my e-bike um, in the next week. Seeing as it's now uh, nice and warm, well it isn't warm, it's about 10 degrees this morning so it's not that warm. I have been looking at uh, bigger wheels, bigger tyres and seeing what is actually possible. I could get another 10 inch tyre in there and, and a wider tyre but I don't really want to do that to be honest because this was made as an M365 sleeper to go like bloody stick. A very unsuspecting sort of a thing and I don't know if it will beat anything off the lights yet <laughs> that's gonna be interesting no it's cold yeah the motor is getting hot there when I say hot I'd say it about 35, maybe 40 degrees. Uh, yep, it will spin. <laughs> oh, I know someone else is going to ask me a question of does it wheelie? I don't know. I'm not going to try. Thank you very much. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to end this one again. And uh, like I say, I'm sorry there's not that much content to it, but you know, I'm out testing. There's nothing to see, nothing to do apart from test. Um, I'm going to go and ramp the voltage up. I'm going to go and ramp the the e-brake up. I've got to knock the curve down, uh, the deceleration curve down and then we should be happy, we should be good to go. So I'm going to end this one and I'll catch you next time. And remember, life is definitely worth living on this measly earth. All you've got to do is get out there, enjoy what you want to do, enjoy everything that you like doing, and bollocks to what everybody else thinks.